hello hello welcome to my channel Noel Lee I am Noel Lee I vlog about my experiences my critical thinking and recount my life if you like the content that I put out and you would like to support me you can do so by WeChat or PayPal now on to the video on the 2nd of April to the 5th of April I embarked on an experience to Xinjiang China in this trip I visited Uramchi, Kashka, and Hotan. This video is the first of three parts compiling my experience visiting these places. According to the law of the People's Republic of China on Public Security Administration and the regulations on civil aviation security of the People's Republic of China, acts of disturbing the order in cabin such as damaging facilities and equipment in flight, smoking, grabbing seat and compartment, disturbing flight attendants' normal work, will be fined. Penalties such as public security detention, severe cases will be investigated for criminal responsibility. <laughs> For you and other passengers' safety, please cooperate with us. Thank you.
So just as we switched off the camera, we actually saw this little settlement. So I think over there, we can actually confirm that there's a settlement. So does that look like uh, maybe a... I don't know, it looks like a... I have no idea. It could be a refinery. could be a camp. It's all speculation, isn't it? Unless we know exactly what it is. So, who can I? Who can tell? How can anybody tell from a distance of this height, of this altitude, seeing something on the ground and giving a definitive verdict on exactly what it is? Unless the person has prior knowledge, right? So, unless we have prior knowledge of exactly what it is. I think it would be uh, unwise for us to make a definitive conclusion. Uh, so we uh, have spotted another settlement. That is surely a settlement, but again, we don't know what it is.
over here is where the security uh, control is. Everybody who enters uh, this uh, area will have to go through the metal detectors and have their uh, baggage scan. So once you are clear on this security, then you are good to be out and about. And feel free to enjoy your day shopping, eating and fun the family. And then you just exit on this side. It's like a concept of a amusement park or a theme park like Disneyland. We're filming here, totally free, and there's policemen walking around me. So it doesn't get more free than that, I guess. How much more free do you want it to be? See, they even got KFC. Look at it. Gonna be catching a train to Kashgar later this evening at five. What I do notice is that, you know, there's more gated conditions in Xinjiang here as compared to Shenzhen, uh, Shanghai. For example, to get into this compound here, where the cars are currently uh, being parked inside, you have to go through, you know, this uh, security. See? So there's only like basically, basically one entry and exit point versus multiple ones traveling for about 16 hours now took the flight from Shenzhen to Rongqi and spent the afternoon uh, checking out the city center and now I'm on the overnight train to Kashgar first time I'm in such a setting basically I'm lying down on the, the topmost uh, bed and uh, yeah I'm gonna get some rest we will check out Kashiga tomorrow and keep on recording. Thank you very much for staying to the end. I hope you enjoyed that video. Until the next part, take care 
and I'll see you guys. We are just arriving in Kashka. Hello. Oh, 